everyone! Welcome to my channel! So today, we're gonna do a DIY trickle filter. I've always wanted to have a trickle filter, but it's really so expensive. Until one day, I was just looking at like a stack um, trays of delivered food. And I just had an idea like, hmm. So watch this. <laughs> Right now, we're gonna do um, Lily's um, trickle filter first, okay? So, this is a DIY trickle filter. So, this is four layers, okay? And, sana gumana, fingers crossed. So, what we're gonna need for the DIY trickle filter is this four microwavable. Actually, I don't have, I, I wanted it to be this big sana. Kailang isa lang yung ganito ko. So, this one would do, I think this is about two and a half inches high or two inches sakto. This is about three inches. Okay. And then, the bio balls. We have lava rings. We have activated um, carbon. And then, we have the the foam. Okay. I don't know yet if I need to put this in, in the net bago ilagay doon or pwedeng direkta na. So, I think pwede namang direkta na. So, the hose. Okay. I have here PVC pipe. Siyempre, yung mga tools natin na gagamitin. Ayan. And the pump. And dito yung pump. Eh. Nalit ko na muna eh. So, eto guys. Um, buo to. Ito yung nakalagay dito sa ibabaw ng tank niya. You can see. Naabot ako. <laughs> so, isang buo siya nakalagay dito. So, pinaputol ko siya so that I can make it like T. So that I can put the basking area here. Okay? Wait! Loko ka. Tinatalon ako. Okay? Tapos dito yun. Shocks! Dito yung trickle filter niya. Tumatalon siya talaga. Oh, loko, loko. Ayan, guys. So, we can start doing it. Ang first I wanna do is, uh, didikit ko na muna to. So, susukatin natin siya. Dun sa ibabaw ng tank ni Lily. Wait lang ah. Halisin muna natin siya kasi nang aabot eh. Ay, wait. Bawasan ko na lang yung water niya. Kasi, I'm supposed to clean her tank na rin naman. So, bawasan natin yung water, guys. Wait. Actually, pinubos ko yung water talaga. Ayan. So, this is what it's gonna look like. There you go. So, we're gonna set this aside to dry. Okay. Okay, guys. Next thing we need to do is cut the PVC pipes. So, I just want it like like about here okay so let's just do two two inches okay so we're gonna measure here two inches okay i'll just mark it with the can i mark it with the cutter i'll just do it directly here okay, okay. Mm, here so just it doesn't have to be like perfect too, okay? I'll just mark that. And then, yep, yes. Trabahong tamad, no? Ayun siya ko siya. Sige. Yes. And this one can be, I can cut it again if I Okay, let's do. Yeah, let's do four for this one. And then if it fails, then we'll just cut it shorter. Okay, there. Okay. So just cut this one, guys. Okay, so I preheated our soldering gun. That's what we're gonna use to make holes <sighs> in it for this one. So first, we need to make a hole like on the side for the for this hose. So 
we're gonna make a hole here on this side. We're gonna cut it. Yeah, I think this one. Okay, just wanna make sure. Um, just to be sure, I'll cut this one first. Okay. Yep, not that one. Okay, so let's cut this one. This is the one. Okay, where's our tub? Okay, here. So, I'm actually gonna cut it like up here. Let's, gonna, let's poke a hole first. La 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 la. <laughs> I'm actually drawing a hole. And, um, let's see if we have the correct size. Perfect! See? Jeez. So I can pull it here. Okay, so did you see what I did there? See? It's better, right? So I think Yeah. Can you see it pointing upwards? So I think I need to make a bit of a space here on top like this. So I need to put silicone on this part. Okay. So. okay, so we have that, but later we still need to poke it in here. So now let's start making holes for the PVC pipe. Oh, okay, just try it. Okay. It to be like this, okay? But we still need to consider the 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 top here, okay? Because we're supposed to put this on top, okay? So. I need to poke a hole on this one as well. gonna go through there so it's gonna look like this okay so, I need something to use to spread it I need something to spread it oh yeah save the board Easy. I have a lot of Sinka board here. So I can spread it easily here. So let's 
press it together. Okay, so we still need to put silicone here. Okay. The one in the middle won't like won't leak because of course the PVC is here. Okay, but I let's just this is just for light. Okay. So we should put my silicone here. Guys, I wanna change silicone. I, I don't trust this one anymore because it it's used already, so I think it's already a bit dried up inside. So I don't wanna use I don't wanna use this anymore. Okay, here we have a new silicone. And also cut it. Oh, see you guys, see the difference. This is clearer than the one we used a while ago. It's a bit cloudy already, so it's, it means it's a bit dried up. So good luck with our glass if it sticks. Okay, I wanna spread it like press it down and spread it like okay. so we're gonna put it here as well okay it's really very important that we can open this guys so when we're gonna clean the filter mediums or filter media or whatever So this one is done. Wait, we'll let it dry. I'll do this first. Anyway guys, so that this video won't be long, I will just be doing the same thing on all um, four, okay? And then I will just show you later the, the part where it's all done, okay? But I will show you how to like put it together, okay? If you can see guys, this one is better. It's clearer. As you can see here, we have the two finished already. So that was the first one we did, and this is the second one I did already. We're just letting it dry, and then this one. Okay. We're gonna put it together now. Like this. Nice. Nice. Okay. Wait, where's the. There you go. Okay. I wanna put the filter the what's this? The foam under here. Okay. okay, so we need to fill this up. Perfect! Okay, so I want it to be like huh, this. We don't need the soldering gun anymore, so I'll unplug it and set this aside.
Look at this guys. <laughs> so this is our first one. The messy one. Yeah, look guys. It's easy to peel off. This is the dried silicone. Eh. See? It's easier to peel off. Wait, I'll just replace this one with the new silicone. Okay guys, so while we're waiting for it, I wanna put this on na, yung kanina, na ginawa na natin. Okay. I wanna put this on already. Dito ko siya nilagay para paraan. <laughs> okay. Anyway guys, I will wait. Let's wait for it to dry up. Okay. Where's my baka? Okay guys, if you can see here, we're done. So, the magic question is, will it work? <laughs> will it work? So, we have the bio balls here. The lava rings, the activated carbon, and the foam. Okay. And I'm actually decorating the tank already before we put this filter, okay? So, you guys, this is it. This is the moment of truth. Here is the plug. Yeah. It's filling up the second level. Okay. Now the third. Okay. Oh, yes! Wow. It's going down? It's going down? Right? Okay. I'm scared. It's like... May tagas agad dun, oh. May lumal. Ay, hindi, hindi pala. Air pala yan. Hmm. Is it overflowing? Will it overflow? Will it overflow? Will it overflow? No. Yay! It didn't overflow! Okay, okay, wait, wait, let's see, let's see, let's see. Ah, oh, there's water, wait. Light, light, light. Hey guys, can you see that? It's working. So look at our trickle filter. Beautiful, we have, like, we have there a tunnel. It doesn't overflow. Ang worry ko guys, pagka if the foam gets dirty, it will overflow. Yeah, it will definitely overflow here. So maybe we should position it like here in the middle. So in case it overflows, dito lang siya mag overflow That's what happened with the previous filter. Eh. When when the foam got dirty, it like overflow na siya. But it's working, guys. It's working. Nice. So there, guys. I just wanna give you an update. So last night something happened when we uh, when we set up the basking area and the trickle filter. So look at this. So, ayan guys, pakita ko lang. The glass before was too long. So, hanggang dito siya. So, yung space, uh, yung space niya here, from this side, parang masyadong saktong-sakto na lang sa, sa taba ni Lily. So, I had to cut the glass. Dapat ipapakat ko, pero tinry kong mag-cut. I have a glass cutter, pero hindi ako marunong. Tingnan nyo nangyari. <laughs> Pero okay na rin, okay na rin yan. At least, ayan, malaki na yung space niya. Tapos yun nga nangyari, guys, nung tinanggal ko to kahapon, para nga nung aay aayusin ko yung glass. Uh, remember, guys, the silicone that we used here, yung dried up na. So, natanggal siya. Tapos, uh, basa ang pangit niya. So, I had to replace it with uh, glue. 
yung super glue, ah, super glue, not super glue guys, uh, hot glue. So, I used hot glue, now it's better. So, naisip ko nga sana, sana hinot glue ko na lang lahat. Although, yung iba naman, hindi naman naglilik. Pero, parang mas safe yata na gamitin hot glue, although I don't know kung tatagal siya. Okay? So, ayan siya guys. So, if you can see, I have here um, her basking area. So, um, that's the next video that I'm gonna upload kung paano natin ginawa yan. And, this replacement uh, flooring. Okay? So, there you go guys. I hope you like this video. Sana may natutunan kayo dun sa paggawa natin ng trickle filter. And please, please guys, don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell so that you will be notified on my next upload. And hit the like button. So, thank you guys for watching. See ya! Bye!